Hi everyone, I am Alina V. Roach and I am 11th grader at Shaker Heights High School. And I am Nichelle Yabiasindra and I'm also an 11th grader at Shaker Heights High School. And we are here to walk you through the My Own Volcano experiment. This experiment will take two days. Before you begin, make sure that you have a clear space and a bowl of water. Here are our materials. This is a volcano base. Make sure that your base has a blue lid. This is the flower. And then take out the newspaper. You can take your newspaper and cut it up into pieces like this. We are going to take our packet of flour and mix it with about one half cup of water. Then we are going to use our spoon to mix the solution until there are no clumps. Next, we are going to take our newspaper shreds and dip them in our flour and water solution. When placing your newspaper on the volcano base, ensure that it does not touch the blue lid because we are going to need to open it later in our experiment. Just keep at adding newspaper until you get the volcano shape that you like. We have completed our volcano. Now it's time to test to see if the top can come on and off. We're good. After you test it, make sure that you put the top on securely. Now set your volcano aside to let it dry for one day. Once the volcano is dry, we can finish the experiment. See you tomorrow. Welcome back, young scientists. Now that you've let your volcano dry for a day, it's time to start painting. So, for this experiment, you can grab your paintbrush and your paint. This one is not? Yeah. Now you're about to rinse that on a little bit. <laughs> now it's time to add our baking soda. Great job! Hello scientists! Did you happen to notice that our lava had a strange smell? That's because our volcano base is made of vinegar. And when vinegar and baking soda come together, there's a chemical reaction. When they come together, they produce a gas called carbon dioxide. That's why you smell that strange smell. I hope everyone enjoyed their experiment. Thank you for watching. Goodbye!